audacious church jester, it is so good to be with you. We are gathering back this week, meeting as church physically. It is going to be incredible. But to make sure that we together have an experience that is both safe and awesome, we've put a couple of things in place to make sure that that happens. So firstly, our car parking is as normal. Our car park hosts will meet you with the biggest smiles on the planet in the car park and direct you to your space. But also please note that this is not the entrance. Follow me and we'll show you how to get into church. So as you come through the back, there's going to be loads of signage to show you how to get into church. But no, this is going to rock your world, Audacious Church. We are going to need you to arrive 30 minutes early to church. I know 30 minutes, but that is going to help you and help us get you registered, get you locked into church and make sure we're ready to go and start what is going to be an awesome experience together. Church, when you come to registration, note there is going to be sanitizing stations, so you make sure you sort those holy hands out first and give them a little pump and a little clean. And then as we move through Reggie, there's going to be hosts who are going to get your details, sign you in. They're going to ask you a couple of questions, a little bit more information, but pretty much everything you've already done online is sorted. You've ticked the boxes, you're ready to go. Okay, Audacious Church, now it gets exciting. We are almost in our church building. But right before we go in, if you're a first time guest with us and you've never been to Audacious Church Jester before, then you can collect your gift from us on us before you enter. And also church, for everybody coming into our building, we need each and every one of you to wear a mask before you come in. So making sure your nose isn't poking out the top and it's not beneath your chin, you can put your mask on right before you join us. But so you can hear me better, I'm gonna take mine off. And why don't you come with me as we enter the building? So by this point, church, one of our incredible hosts will have met you at the door, taken you to your seat. And note that as you sit down, at all times, there will always be a two seat gap between you and any other household that aren't from your house. Now, at this point, there's five things that we need you to remember as you come into church. The first thing is that as we meet physically together, there will be no singing in church. So there will be no making a joyful noise to the Lord, but that doesn't mean you can't worship while you're in church. So within your space, feel free to dance, jump, clap along and worship God as we meet together. The second thing we need you to know as you come into church is that church is a hug free zone. Smile, wave, from a distance, but from this point on until guidance changes, which hopefully will be soon, it will be a hug-free zone. The third thing is, is that it will be a contact-free zone, meaning that everything we do as we've done online so far when you've been at home will be contactless. There will be QR codes on your seat so you can scan, you can give in the offering, you can engage with the service as normal. The fourth thing is we need you to remember is that kids will remain online. There will be no kids program here at church, but that doesn't mean your kids can't come to church with you. But please remember at all times, kids will need to stay with you and be with you as you'll be responsible for looking after them. And the last thing church is this, is that there may be and probably will be queues for the toilets. We have a one-way system flow in and out of the building that is obvious and is marked so that when you need to go to the bathroom at any point, it will be obvious where you need to go and where you need to get to. So church, why don't you come with me as we head out of the building? Because remember that as you're about to leave church, there is a whole host of people queuing out the back, ready to come in for what will be our 12 o'clock service. And our incredible team need to disinfect and make sure that this zone is just as safe for them as it was for you at the 10 o'clock. So why don't you come with me and we'll head out of church. Church, we love you. Can't wait to see you this Sunday.